The mission of our institute is to contribute to international community through policy relevant research on sustainability. Asia mega cities are facing problem in the water quality, water pollution caused by climate change, economic growth, as well as population increase. Our institute is in the position to provide the policy makers with scientific knowledge in addressing water problem. Firstly, water is life. The second is uh, water is um, the link between our body and all environment. The other aspect of the water is the disaster. If we not well manage. Well, we have to realize that uh, due to uh, lack of access to safe water and good sanitation. So at present, about one million people die every year due to this preventable waterborne disease. So this number of death is much greater than disease caused by Ebola or by MERS now. People have to boil water for drinking and water pollution cause uh, loss of uh, fishery in some country. So besides health effects, also economic loss due to water problems in urban areas are also very much affected the human uh, well-being and also sustainability problem. WI Water and Urban Initiative is a flagship project of the IAS United Nations University. I started this project in collaboration with their, our founder, Ministry of the Environment. The final goal of the project is to determine the value of the water in urban system and to predict the value to their future. South and Southeast Asia, there are many countries uh, that are less developed and uh, population growth is quite high. Due to poverty, most people have to migrate to urban area to find employment. So when you come to urban area, of course, uh, it creates environmental problem due to uh, lack of uh, space and uh, crowded area. And each people need at least 100 liters of water per day. So the situation creates water scarcity and also lack of access to safe water. In the future, problem of water will be more and more serious. Firstly, leadership has to recognize the importance of science for making sustainable development of the city, the first. And they use scientific discovery, design for making that planning uh, strategies, uh, action plan, all, and management. Second, uh, science have to see, to study and forecast the challenge today and the future to propose not only strategic, sound scientific, but also technical method suitable for the implementation. Scientists have to make uh, they are discovery easy to know and be easy implemented and with very reasonable cost. I think these uh, projects are very important and timely because uh, as we know that uh, in the future, like 20, 30 years, uh, people predict that there will be huge water scarcity, water shortage, there might be even war fighting for water. We do have collaboration with Japan universities can solve the above mentioned water problem in Asian countries or in anywhere. Eventually we want to expand this in depth for around 20 cities in the Asian region. I hope that water sustainability could be available or achieved in the near future.